Hi, this is Sam Guan with Siemens PRM Software. Today, I will share with you the pattern components functionality inside of NX Assembly. Pattern components are very similar to pattern feature. Our colleague John Baker has shared with you um, his approach of using pattern feature inside of NX. So in this case, I've already added a particular pattern uh, of a support arm on one side. What I want to do is I want to maximize the design on the other side. By using the pattern components, I will let the NX do the calculation for me, the maximum amount of support structure that I can have on this side of the rail. So I want to go ahead and just select the geometry. I want to go ahead and define that geometry, which direction I want it to go. In this case, I have a distance of a, of a pitch, about 100 millimeters, so I get about five instances of the original design on this end. So as I drag this further out, I see that I can get more, but however, that exceeds the locations of the rail. So that will not do me any good. So I want to go back in to make sure that, that I stay within the current design of this rail system on this side. So what I want to go ahead and just duplicate that on both, both ends. So I end up with 11 instances or 10 instances of this particular support arm on this side at this time. So I want to go ahead and add rest of the components in this. Notice how quickly NX will duplicate each one of those components on this particular side. As I see uh, once they're being instantiated that there is some interference of the geometry. So I know that having 11 support arms on this side might not be the best idea because that means the support arms will run into one to the other. So what I want to do is go ahead and increase my pitch distance to make sure that there's no interference. By doing so, NX automatically decreased the number of the support arm structure on this side. So instead of 11, I end up with only seven on this side. So this is kind of quick result that I get with pattern components. Once that is done, because of decreased number of the having components, being instantiated on this side, that forced me to go out to make one of those arm to move out even further. That will create additional stability in this particular arm at the uh, support. So I want to go ahead and increase that. You notice that that particular subassembly of the arm support structure moves out. Using pattern components inside of NX give users quickly to be able to create instantiated associative uh, components inside the assembly. Thank you.